Hi guys, I have a card share for you today. It's a sympathy card. Um, are you, I'm not quite sure which stamp set this is from, but it is a clear stamp set. I think it's like a flowers of the year stamp set. But it just, it's a clear stamp set. Has different months with different flowers. I'm not quite sure what company makes that. Um, but I stamped it right on there and I colored it with the Spectrum Noir markers. I used the CG2 and the CT2. And I did use a Stampin' Up set. It's called Tape It. I got this stamp set just for this card. I really like all the different stuff you get with it. I think it'll be neat. It's like washi tape or whatever. I don't really use washi tape, but I think I'll actually use these stamps because you can do some really cute cards. I was looking up on Pinterest, different ones. Um, and then I used a Stampin' Up, I think it's Tiny Wishes, something like that, stamp set with some the and for these flowers up here, I just stamped this stamp a second time on a different sheet of paper. And then I cut them out and I put them on pop dots. And then this ribbon, I just did two, just one long one, one short one. And then I used the Stampin' Up Ticket Punch to do the corners. I did a black Sharpie. And I just did my own dotted line so it looked like stitching around it. I took a black ink pad and went around the edges of this card. Just edging, like wiping it on there a little bit. I used a green Stampin' Up ink pad for the, this color. It is... Oh, I have my little... I made a little color swatch on there because... These are not always true to what color it actually looks like, so I made my own swatches. But this is called Certain Certainly Celery. I don't know if this is continued. I've had this ink pad for probably five or six years. It still works. Um, I think that is all. The cardstock I used is Recollections. But otherwise, that is my card that I wanted to share with you guys. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.